What's going on everybody? It's your boy iPod King Carter here. Today I'm bringing you guys a new update to my NBA All Net team. Now, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be doing All-Star Challenge today. So basically, I need everybody to bear with me while I lose all my diamonds. So look, check it out. We're going to go to the shop, check out cards. Right now, only Kevin Durant and Russell Westbrook are due for Mythic cards. But in Gears and Resources, we're going to go ahead and hit over the Special. We got LeBron James, Steph Curry, Shaq Pieces, Allen Iverson, Dwayne Wade, James Harden, Kevin Durant, and Carmelo Pieces. Now, you guys will see I have 422 pieces from All-Star Challenge. But what I'm going to be doing is wasting all my diamonds in a battle right here, right now. So, All-Star Challenge for me has not been completed today. Event ends the 30th, but... I want to show you guys that I've done basically all my tasks for the day. You guys will see 100 out of 120. I've claimed all of my rewards. Uh, let's see. Road to Glory. I made it up to 113. You know, battling it out. But I did lose three times. So I cannot battle anymore there. Um, League. I gave up my entire legendary team. All of my legendary cards that were maxed out and everything like that. I gave them up, consumed them, and just got over it, man. Now it's time for me to work on this team right here, this mythic team. So if you guys see here, I was I was basically demoted to level three, but um, I'll most likely probably be uh, upgraded to level two. Hopefully, I'll be on a uh, in division two. Now trending players right now, these are like all the crazy trending players, but uh. I'm going to go ahead and back out, get straight into this all-star challenge. I know why you guys are here. I know why you guys are here. So uh, basically, um, I got, what, 6,737 6, diamonds. Uh, let's see how many I end up with after all of this is said and done. Also, I need you guys to do the math for me. I'm not too great at math. No, I'm lying. But I do want to uh, see how many uh, diamonds I do have left after this is over. So let's hop straight up into it. Now, uh, Steve Nash, everybody's saying that he's one of the best point guards in this game. I mean, bar none, probably the best point guard. And it's funny to me, you know, because, you know, we got Steph, we got uh, Westbrook, we got even um, older guys, you know, just being dominant in the league, you know, in real life. But they're saying this game is just something about that Nash, baby, so... I'm, going, I'm still chasing them, man. I'm still chasing this Nash. I'll show you guys an update of how uh, Nash and Klay Thompson are going from my last video. If you guys missed that video, uh, the link to the playlist probably is in the description. Not totally sure, but I know you guys will be able to find it. All you got to do is search NBA on that on YouTube, and I'll probably pop up in the search. Now, uh, let's skip this. All right, I'm just, I'm just getting as many tokens as I can get. I know I'm probably moving a little bit too fast for you guys, so... I'll slow things down and uh, let you see my actual winnings. Now, uh, I got a perfect there. But the more I go into this All-Star Challenge, the more diamonds I will spend. So, I do not need people to laugh at me, man. Please do not laugh at me. Now, what I want to, you know, tell you guys about All-Star Challenge is... So, basically, when you go to draw Mythic cards, you have a very mediocre chance of actually winning that card and you get about 20 to 25 maybe even sometimes 30 pieces of a mythic card when you're drawing so basically you know that's that's your way to get mythic cards is to basically gain as many pieces as possible now remember when you're drawing you're spending up to 600 diamonds per draw but here on All-Star Challenge, you start off with zero. Now, for every amount of winnings that you get, you get tokens from All-Star Challenge. Now, let me go ahead and skip this and kind of explain it. So basically here, I got a perfect score. I acquired 12 All-Star tokens in one match, which probably cost me, let's see, around 200 diamonds, right? Now, for every... I would say like 10 to 15 pieces of all-star token you can get mythic pieces here so basically starting from zero and then going to the max number is actually a little bit better than actually drawing cards but all-star challenge is not available every day of the week all week 
um they actually have special events where all-star challenge is available just like how it says when you're in the all-star challenge menu that it ends on the 30th you have until the 30th to actually acquire as many tokens as possible now person like me i would probably grab some diamonds right as soon as the day is announced and probably try to farm as much as i can for a couple days like um i'll get a bunch of diamonds um then every day i'll do all my tasks get as many diamonds as i can from those things and then keep drawing but remember you get three free draws for zero diamonds so you definitely if you're not into getting diamonds if you're not into purchasing diamonds you might want to do those three even though you know you can't go for the long haul just get some tokens because maybe those tokens will come in handy for some pieces later down the road now i'm currently spending 400 diamonds per draw now what i'm going to do is i'm going to speed this up here and i'm going to skip i only got a good here i'm spending 400 diamonds for 10 all-star tokens now remember that number 400 diamonds for 10 all-star tokens okay now uh, i have about 10 more tries left for today and i just got a perfect here for 400 diamonds i just got 20 all-star tokens all right let's continue that now um remember when you're getting the all-star tokens you are putting this to a card um so basically you have to already have either some type of piece or you know something like that and never i mean never go for mythic pieces just pieces always go for the player pieces go for the jugular do not waste your all-star tokens on just random mythic pieces to build up a player if you want to get mythic pieces go ahead and infuse about five legendary cards and then get 30 pieces from that don't go out and you know spend all your your all-star tokens which you spent a lot of diamonds to earn on that now what i can say is the the fastest way to earn uh mythic pieces from putting in legendary cards is to do the actual free giveaway of the card from legendary like when you're drawing a legendary card and it says free make sure all your luck is full every time you do it and make sure you get that guaranteed legendary card and make sure you do not use it in coaching if you use it in coaching you won't be able to fuse it because you already used it now uh, i got two challenges left let's see what we do here um this level 65 team they, they got this work man this time around now let's see challenge one more time and this is the last challenge and we're gonna go ahead and skip that and i got 15 tokens out of that i have zero challenges left today now let's see do i have anything here oh look at that look at that hold up i forgot i did pur I, I did purchase some diamonds back then did i or did i claim already oh yeah yeah i claimed them already okay now this right here is basically what you would get if you spent this much let me see what you get you get 50 universal pieces and three allen irisons that's, that's pretty dope three dikembe's and some star garn and star crystal that all-star team logo oh, that, that logo pretty fire though all right let's go back now remember guys when i was drawing i was actually getting luck as well so basically i got 2100 luck and guess what i can get remember i told you that you can get a free legendary card and that's if your luck bar is full you have a 100 percent chance of pulling a legendary card now i just pulled this legendary card i'm gonna go ahead and use this in a fusion i mean not fusion well actually i do mean fusion i'm sorry uh use this in a, in a quick fusion real quick and one two three four five go ahead and confirm that use that 100,000. get that up out the way real quick all right so i got kobe bryant one chris paul piece and 30 universal mythic pieces now before i show you guys the rest of my all-star challenge i'm gonna go ahead and hit this east versus west real quick just to put my name in the middle real fast now uh <laughs> When I'm recording this, there's probably about eight minutes left. Oh, okay, seven minutes left. There's seven minutes left until this event is over. And I just came up in here on a late night, you know what I'm saying? Just like, you know what? Let me get my feet wet real quick. I'm gonna just dabble for a moment. 
Now you guys notice that I use more than 60, what is that, 6,500 maybe, diamonds? Because I think I had, what, 67 something? Yeah, so I think I, think I might have used about 6,500 diamonds to pull all the pieces that I pulled. Now this is taking forever. Let me go ahead and cancel that and then queue it back up. Now it should give me a match within 10 seconds. Unless it, unless it wants to jerk me. Come on, all I need is one match just to get a couple um coin. Come on, don't hate on your boy. I'm recording for YouTube here. Okay, there we go. All right, so I tricked it into giving me a nice leeway. And we're gonna go ahead and speed it up. I always speed up my matches because they, they work a whole lot better when I'm uh, actually skipping them. So basically when you put it on the fastest, whatever player you have, look at that, barricade. I'm gonna have to take a screenshot of that. No, nope, I got a barricade, a large one, and he got 10 points or 10 field goals, okay. All right, now let's go over to the actual gears and resources, go back to special. Okay, so when I started the video, I had 400 pieces of all-star tokens. Now I have 779. Now, if I wanted, I could spend 15 uh, tokens on 10 pieces of Shaq. All right, that's if I wanted to, but right now I'm working on Steve Nash and Clay Thompson. So Steve Nash, once he's available in this special box, I'll go ahead and get him. But just to give you guys an update on how those guys are going, um, Steve Nash right now is rank six. He's level 34, going on to level 35 in about eight hours. Clay Thompson is level 29, rank six, and he'll be level 30 in five hours. Some change. Now we also have Moses Malone at level 44, going to level 45, rank six, and he's eviled one time. And then we have Dominique Wilkins, same level, um, same rank, and he's being worked on right now. He's also eviled once. Now, uh, as for rank, I'm ranking up my Steve Nash next. Um, he will be rank seven in about four, four and a half hours. And as of right now, everything else is just, you know, I just play it by ear. You know, I'm, I'm ranking my dudes up, I'm coaching my dudes. I'm just making sure that, you know, in a couple of days to like maybe a week and a half, I, I can have a, a better team as well. Um, I do want to rank up um, Kobe Shaq. Kobe Shaq and uh, who else? I think it's LeBron James. I want to rank them up to rank nine, but right now I'm working on Steve Nash and them. So, you know, as soon as I get them up, I'll I'll try to rank them up because right now I have 421 rubies and 387 emeralds. So I have almost a complete set to rank up somebody to level um, nine, and I have 17k. I'm, I'm sorry, not 17k, 17 million worth of coin. So, you know, all the coin that I've made out of all these draws and, you know, playing All-Star Challenge, I got it all. So, just encouraged him, gave him a little bit of boost there. Now, uh, I guess it's time for me to get up out of here, man. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, I definitely enjoy spending all my diamonds for you guys. Thanks a freaking lot. Um, also, P level 8. I have to get to P level 9 real soon, man. I'm going to try to get to P level 9, but um, I got to save some money. So, uh, <laughs> this is IKC signing out. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll holler at you in the next one. Peace. Yeah.